What's up guys? It's King Daddy DMac and welcome back to another episode of Hermit FTB. Oh yeah, baby. Playing on the Hermitcraft server using the monster pack as always. So how's everybody doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. I wanted to mess around today a little bit with some more tools. I didn't realize this, but Tinkers actually got a couple of upgrades in the last the update that we had for monster the update was a little while ago a few weeks ago maybe even a month ago but i never noticed so i think i'd like to play around with it um mostly with the swords um as you can see i've been using the essence sword for the last few episodes and i thought it was pretty cool but apparently people said the tinkers is far better far far better so why don't we mess around with some of that let's flip around and last time we're doing all the MFFS stuff, the teleportation, and that episode actually hasn't aired yet, hasn't gone up yet. So I don't, I asked you a few questions in that episode, make sure to go back and answer them for me. I was trying to figure out about better ways to get power so that we could do some crazy, crazy big massive teleportations. But um, yeah, today I want to stick to the tools. So, 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 what do we have cooking in here? It's been a while since we've been at the tree base. Looks like we have some aluminum brass, some copper, little uh, minium, ardite, whole bunch of different stuff. But I'm gonna, in particular, let's see, do I have the books on me? Yeah. Let's look at these books. In particular, the thing that I want to do, I want to try and get, we've done a cleaver before, I might make another cleaver. This battle axe looks kind of cool. I was thinking of maybe doing that. We got to get a bow. We haven't had a bow this entire series. Let's see. There's daggers, longsword, broadsword. There's another one. Oh, yeah, the rapier. <laughs> oh, that makes me laugh every time I say it. Um, the, uh, Yeah. So I'm going to cook up a bunch of these. I want to use these uh, manillium blades. Let's see. It tells you... For that, and I may not be saying it right, but for that, let's see. So, for that, you get 1.5. It's kind of, uh, let's find it. Where is it? Okay, cobalt of the uh, the higher class materials. Cobalt gives 1.5 hearts. Ardite also does 1.5, but the uh, manilium gives two hearts. So, that seems to be the highest material out of any of them so i'm gonna make a bunch of that to make that let's just see we need this book tells me i wish they had it all in the nei it's kind of annoying maybe they do two cobalts and two ardites which should be no problem why well i've been using the magic crops to get all these essence and i have tons of it i've had a farm going for a long time now but is that how you do it What's the use? Okay, make a little hole in the middle. Boom. Look at that. So all the Ardite. All the Ardite. And we have like hundreds of thousands of that. Let's see for the Cobalt. Is the Cobalt also that same way? Yep, also that same way. So tons and tons of it. So why don't I get all this cooking up? I don't know if I have to drain that. Hopefully I don't have to. But let's get both of those in there. Hopefully we'll get a bunch more of this Minulium. And we'll make some tools. So let me figure out what do I want to use. What do I want to use for the rest of it? I'm thinking probably paper. Just so that we can get all the modifiers. Where does it say what the modifiers are? So for the paper, handle modifier is only 0.3. But it gives you an extra trait over here. So that's interesting. Um, flux capacitors. I didn't realize in the video with Jassassin. <laughs> I, I could see it. I didn't know what happened, but apparently I threw it out and it blew up. So I got to make another one of those guys. And I actually had the high highest tier one. Okay, right here. So here we can get another extra modifier. This is old. This with the diamond, the gold block. But check this out. This is new. We get need another modifier with a golden apple. I don't know which golden apple that is. Solid gold apple. Huh. And a diamond block. And then a third one. With the nether star. So that was in two, but this one's new. So we can put an extra modifier in all of our tools. There's also this one. I got this golden head. It just showed up in my inventory when we did the update, but 
effects, it gives additional modifier slots. So I don't know if that can only work in creative or anytime or what. But it's pretty neat, pretty neat. So anyway, let's see how this is cooking up. Oh, nice. And let me get a whole, all the different, the different heads. Let's see. So sword blade cast. Gonna want that. The large one. Let's see. Let's knock these out of here. And let's put on our sword blade ones. So sword. Oh, crud. Is that the right one? Is that a sword blade? What is this one? Yeah, sword blade. Okay. Let's throw on the large one as well. Let's get these three small ones out of the way first. And then I guess we have enough to do that one too. So we do that. Wide guard and tool rod. 4.5 hearts. Okay, okay. Let me see, do I have more paper in here? All right, let's grab some paper. Now let's compare this if it changes at all, if we do it in paper. Make a couple of those. All right, so let's go back over here now. Now this does 4.5 like that, and let's put the normal sword back up there. Okay, so if we replace one, like show, 4.5, still the same, so only the durability goes down. All right, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, and it still stayed at 4.5. So I think that might be our best bet. The only other possibility, I have two Thaumium ingots I found in a chest. And people are saying that that's actually one of the better materials to use instead of paper. But it's not melting down. So I don't know what to do. I'm not sure how that works. You guys let me know in the comments. And that's really the only reason I wanted to get into Thaumcraft is so that I could make those Thaumium ingots. Oh, so frustrating. Maybe I need a the special um a special tool forge. That could be it. So anyway, let's take this guy out. Since we've now confirmed that the paper seems to be the best. So we've got that guy, that was 4.5. Let's go ahead, let's make up the other shorge. So let's put in here, this guy, that one, that one, and that one. All right, long sword, cool. Let's make the, I think it's the rapier now. Alright, so that's only 2.5 hearts. This one was, what did it say it was? That's plus 8, plus 4, okay, that's where it tells you if you just hover over. Plus 8, plus 4, plus 8. Alright, cool. So now let's get on all the modifiers. Let's put on, I guess, the max number of stuff. So boom. <laughs> Boom. 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 And the final one. Boom. Boom. All right, sweet. So now we got all of our modifiers. Let me clear out my inventory. Let's get all of our stuff on. So the first one I wanted to put on was charging. All right, so now it's rechargeable. Cool. I just want to see. You can't make this have more stuff, can you? No. So you can only do once with flux. Let's now do the looting. All right. I think this is the last one for the looting part. All right. So 450 is what? Wasn't I already at it? No. One more. Still looting two. Now it's the max looting. All right. So how many modifiers do we have left? We have six modifiers left, so now I guess the rest I'll just do in all sharpness. So let me do this one up. All right, I think this is the final one in my final modifiers. Bam! 
All right, and it doesn't look like I have any modifiers left. 14 hearts of damage. That's oh, plus 27. That's really good. Look at it. Only plus 9 in the Essence Sword. Oh, that was weak. Now, could this even go higher? I don't know. That might be the max. I'm going to try it out now. Let's do another one. See, that was plus eight. So why don't we try this guy, the long sword? And let's see if we can use this one and just... Because it had the same damage output. Let's see if we can get this one, how how high it can go. All right, here we go. Plus 30. Freaking insane. All right, can we go up even higher? Oh my goodness. It can. Holy crud nuggets. All right, so we can go up even higher, but we ran out of modifiers. I don't know, guys. Let me know. Is there a maximum to this if you can keep on adding modifiers? That would be pretty crazy. Um, I'm going to add on, though, just because I want to have this guy have charge. I'm going to add on the flux thing to it. And that one will be at plus 30 and without looting. So pretty cool. Long sword. And the final one is the, uh, the rapier. The unique trait, yeah, this doesn't have as much damage to it, but the unique trait is it goes through armor. So it actually could, I guess, potentially be the more powerful weapon. So why don't we put on, did we put the flux on yet? Let's put flux on it. And then let's just max this guy out as well with the quartz. All right, guys, so we've got everything maxed out. The highest one being, of course, the longsword at the plus 30. The rapier ends it up being at plus 22, but ignores the armor damage. And we could have had these all one higher. But you know what? I feel like it's kind of strange. Like, I don't know. If paper, is that really the best? I made um, a broadsword out of all manilium. And I just want to see if we max this out. Could, maybe it would end up being higher because there's this whole... The, the modifier thing where it tells for each tool, does it tell us here? Let's see. I'm still not sure what this, this modifier part is. Handle modifier. See, because the paper only has 0.3. So I'm not even sure what that would do. So let's just see what that ends up being once I max it out. All right, guys, not extremely impressive. So here going in, only one modifier remaining. And yeah, only 12.5. So I mean, look at that. Going with mostly paper just to add those extra modifiers really makes a huge, huge improvement. So this guy, I'm going to kind of ditch. I'm not going to even waste any more materials on for now. Throw all of our extras here. Bam, 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 bam. Let's throw our book back. Bam. Sweet. So now comes the fun part. Let's get these all charged up. Oh, look at that. That's so weird how you hold it. What does it look like? Oh, let's flip me around. <laughs> That's so weird how he holds it. it. Looks like a pickaxe or something. You hold that so goofy. Normal sword. Oh, this is the broadsword, so it makes you jump forward. Oh. Okay, we'll test them out in a minute. So, let's go charge up. Alright, we're back at spawn. And I think I'm going to try the deep dark again. I'm still a little, a little afraid. Oh, 69 XP level. Still a little afraid. I got a book, though, to make sure... What? Portal to deep dark. Okay. I don't think I have night vision on, though, this time. So, hopefully, we won't die. And I'll actually recognize where there's shade. Ooh, it's dark everywhere. We need torches. Do we have any? Oh, crud nuggets. All right, let's make some torches real quick. It's kind of important. All right, so we have torches that we can light up and we won't get hurt by the deep dark. Oh, forgot to make a bow. We can do that later. All right, let's see. 20. Wow, so much. This one had looting on it. Let's find some more guys. Alright, there's a creeper. Come here! Oh, the creepers run away from me, remember? 
Wow, so it's still not a one-shot kill, but we're getting pretty close, getting pretty close. So let's try some of the other weapons. Come on, I'd expect there to be more mobs in here. All right, let's try the longsword. 29, pretty good. 32, cool. You know what, it said something about there being like a charge making a difference. This is so bizarre, I thought there were supposed to be tons of mobs in here. Where are all you guys? Alright, let's try the rapier. Alright, so it didn't really seem, it looks like it's still a two hit kill. So I wonder if maybe I could use like a strength pendant or something. Maybe that would give me the extra boost that I need. All right, here's some more guys. Oh, I wanted to have a one hit kill all the time. Come here. Oh, that's kind of pisses me off. Where might I use up all my torches already? All right, so let's head back. It's a little disappointing, but, you know, it is what it is. Maybe I'd have to just go completely maxed out to get it. Because it doesn't look like we have to do much more damage. Oh, should I do it? Should I make one more just to see if it's a one-hit kill without having the recharge? I don't know. It might be worth it. These swords, though, are definitely the best. Definitely that I've seen. So if there's anything better, let me know. Otherwise, we'll just do that final test. To see if we get the strongest sword ever. Alright, I made another broadsword and I also made a cleaver. And this guy might have even more modifier possibilities. Because I think that's three modifiers that it can get. So it does swing slower and you get fatigue. Mining fatigue. But... It may be a one-hit kill on everybody, which would maybe pay off, maybe. I think if, as long as we, yeah, as long as we move it, it goes away. So that's pretty cool. All right, so let's get these guys all beefed up. All right, so no more can go on, right? Right? All right, so what's this guy? 33. Let's see if that's enough to do a kill, but this cleaver... I went up, there's still one modifier even remaining, and it's already at 46. So let's try these guys out. Oh, this is absolutely nuts. Let's see, this guy, Nexus. I think the cleaver should be a one hit kill for sure. I'm really hoping, because I'd like to be able to put the recharge on it. Whoa. All right, where's some guys? All right, there's a guy. Let's get him. Oh, one hit for sure. Every day, all day. All right, where's some more guys? Stay in the light. You know what? Maybe we should go somewhere else to test this. Because I am feeling a little scared. Oh, oh my God. Let's get out of here. Maybe we can try it in the end. How do we get to the end again? Let's go back. Mm. You know what, just Assassin's Base might even be a good place to go. I think this is where all the freaking mobs in the server went. We gotta wait till nighttime though. So, we'll be right back. All right, we're in the nether. I was sick of waiting for nighttime. So let's see if we can find some guys, see what we can do for damage. Alright, we got... Whoa! Alright, so let's try this. Oh my god! One shot. Oh, 46. This guy would never be a one shot though. Oh my god, what is going on? I'm getting raped! Holy crud! Alright, is this guy one shot? One shot? The cleaver's pretty dang good. What is going on here? 
these things are like just stuck. Oh, there you are, you little turd. Oh my god! Oh, that would look like a one shot. See, how much health does this guy have? Whoa! Alright, so that's pretty cool. These guys aren't really a good test, though, for comparing to normal mobs. Ooh, what was that noise? This cleaver is absolutely boss, though, and all I gotta do is switch off of it. Oh, you know what? I'm getting nausea because of the pendant. And all sorts of other effects that aren't good. Ooh, one hit on the pigmen on this new sword. That's pretty cool. Oh. The nether's still just a mess, though. So, I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty happy, I guess. You know, that pigman was one hit. Let's try the deep dark again. Alright, here's a guy with armor. Alright, that didn't really count though, because he had armor. Come on, guys! Alright, there's another one over there. You have armor too. Where's a guy with non-armor? Let's try and rush through here quick. It's interesting, why did I take no damage? I was in the dark there. This building's so cool, colored bricks black. Where Cory was. A spider. Can we get some mobs, please? Try and stay along the light. Spider. One hit. Cool. Yeah, so it was just that one last little thing that we needed. I'm gonna find a zombie. Come on, guys. See, the creeper wasn't a one hit kill before. Let's see. Oh, still not, and that did 35. Wow. Let's see, zombie. Whoa! Fishing rod zombie. All right, still not. So, yeah, the cleaver, it looks like it's about the only way to do it. I think we still, no, we didn't have any modifiers left on that guy. But on the cleaver, we do. So I'll put recharging on the cleaver. Seems like it's the absolute just most boss weapon for doing damage, but you can't swing as quick. So that's where the pay the uh, the payoff is. Anyway, I think that's gonna about do it, guys. I've had enough of testing. I gotta take off. It is Friday night. Of course, this isn't gonna go up till Monday. Oh, is this not how we get home? I don't even know how we get home. Like that. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. As always, if you enjoyed, please remember to leave a thumbs up. It helps me out oh so much. And yeah, help me out with any comments, any other improvements that I should do or should know about for tinkers, how to get that thaumium, um, and just more power tools. I'd like to get like a broadsword that did a one shot on everybody. Don't know if that's possible, but yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching and peace out.